Welcome to Snail Trail 4x4. Today we're going to be installing wheel spacers on a 5th gen 4Runner. Welcome to Snail Trail 4x4. I'm Jimmy Jet. Today we're installing wheel spacers on the 5th gen 4Runner. Wheel spacers are a great way to get just a little bit more track width whenever you need that. It's just a bolt-on application that goes right over your wheel hubs. In this case, it goes right over the rotors for the brakes and it probably won't take us more than i don't know 20 minutes total tops maybe a little bit more 45 to take the wheels on and off and things along those lines it's a quick and easy install that is good to get more track width so i'm going to apply just a little bit of red loctite to every single one of these studs here sticking through the wheel we don't want these things coming undone i just do a simple line on top and then I let the bolt, it'll thread it around, spread it all out as needed. Just a little bit, you don't need to overdo it. You need to save some for the other side. Once that's on, I'm gonna lay over the nice pretty spacer. Here we go. And then these bolts are curved on this side and it's curved on the inside, so it's gonna get a good seal. You wanna make sure that you're pushing this curved side in first. All right, so now what we're gonna do is we're gonna to torque every single one of these down to 85 foot-pounds of torque in a star method. So I'm gonna go here, 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 and then do that all again, just to double check it. So I've got Brennan up in the cab. He's actually pushing down on the brakes, and that's gonna hold these in place. All right, one more time around. There we go. All right, 85 foot pounds all the way around. Now we're gonna jack it up, put the tire back on, and we're done on this side. The best way or most comfortable way that I've found to lift some big heavy tires like these, these are uh, 285, 7, 75, 17s pretty much uh, 34 inch tires. So what I do is I like to actually use my legs. I will get underneath them, make sure that you slide it in all the way. And then I use my legs to pinch and lift. My legs are so much stronger than my arms. That way I can see, I can have my hands and I can use my hands and I can see what I'm doing. And I can make sure that I'm lined up on those um, studs and then it just slides on in. So I use my legs to pinch and lift. It's the easiest way I've found. Thanks for watching this episode of Snail Trail 4x4 where we installed the wheel spacers on all four corners of the 5th Gen 4Runner. Wheel spacers are a great way to get a little bit more of track width and they're really easy to install. Just make sure that you're doing all the factory specs and making sure you're torquing everything down to what it needs to be. You don't want that wheel falling off for any random reason. So hammer down on that subscribe button and make a comment below if you like these videos and you want to see more of them. And don't forget... Keep crawling.